Oh, hey there. Just fooling around here a little bit. You scared me there. Bet you're here for another video. Well, let me do another video here for you. Today, I'm going to just dig out maybe two of my German flags and show you. So uh, I'll jump in here and I'll show you two really nice German flags from World War II. All right, here's the first one I'm going to show you. It's a state flag. This is perfect size here. It's uh, three feet, maybe one or two inches by five feet, maybe an inch or two. But these are perfect size. Cause these, these don't take up much wall space at all if you want to hang them up or just throw them over the table, put a little display on them. Just, they're just perfect. I have another one of these, and, and it's a real big one. It's like eight feet long. And a friend of mine, his grandfather brought it back. And they got it off a building in Raymogen. So that was pretty cool to know that that flag actually came from Raymogen, which was they did a, you know, a famous battle there in Raymogen, over the, the Ludendorff Bridge. But it's got uh, just a couple of stains on it, but it's, it's in great condition. And there is the uh, manuf uh, manufacturer that's the size 100 by 170. Yes, that means state building. And if we go over here on this side, we got the manufacturer there. Got the ropes on both ends, perfect condition. There's no rips or tears at all on this flag. And you can see, you got the stitching, six stitches right there on the side of it, going all the way around. And here's the ends of the rope on this side. And you can see the six stitches that go around it there. And here's a close up of that. Yeah, it's just double double printed. Now I'll get the next one out. The next one's a uh, German sports flag. I've been wanting one of them for a long time, and a friend of mine sold me his a while back. All right, now here's my favorite flag in the whole collection. Like I say, it's a German sports flag. And you can see on the left side of it, it's still got the pull rings, and there's a tie down in the left corner. This is, uh, I would say, maybe four and a half feet square. Now we'll get down here, and I'll show you the embroidery on this one. I thought they were printed, but they're not. This thing's embroidered. I don't know how good you can see that, but... Yeah, real nice embroidery to it. Never thought I'd get one of these. Now we'll take a look at the eagle right up close. There, you can see the embroidery a little better on that. This one isn't as in good shape as my last one, but uh, there's a lot of little moss holes in this. And, and uh, right there, you can see there's a small tear. Got a hole right there. And there's just a lot of little small holes in it. But it's... Really nice flag. There's the loops there to, for the pole to go down and through. There's uh, six of those. And then it's got one tie there on this corner. And it's got a tear in it.
I just looked at these loops and there's no markings on them or in them, but they're pretty nice. And uh, it's flags the same on both sides. It's uh, real nice embroidered on both sides. Mm -hmm. See, this one's got a lot of damage to it. But I got it at a real good price. So I had to kill two birds with one stone, able to buy it, plus getting it at a good price. Here's another up close with better lighting of the embroidery. And like I say, this is my favorite one in the collection. Looking for that small Kriegs flag now. Hey, don't forget we got the Max Show coming up in less than two weeks. I'll be there on Friday. If anybody sees me, just kick me in the butt and say hi. Alrighty then. Hope you enjoyed that video. And there were two, uh, two of my best flags I got in my collection. You know, two of my favorites anyway. You know, I got maybe... I don't know, r roughly maybe 14, 15 flags in the collection. And uh, yeah, right now I'm looking for a Kriegsmarine flag, a small one. You know, I see the big ones out there all the time and really can't do nothing with them big ones, but I want the small ones so you can hang them up or, you know, use them for you know, a little table display or whatever. But uh, anyway, see you on the next video. Have a good weekend.